May we never experience it in our life again. Both our families, close ones, and all our very wishes. On October 5th, 2023, five female students from the Federal University to Sima, Castina State, were abducted and subsequently liberated after 74 days in captivity. At the State House, Nigeria's First Lady, Senator Luremi Tinubu, has extended a warm welcome to four of the recently freed students. She expressed gratitude for the unwavering trust Nigerians placed in God and the country's security agencies throughout the ordeal. The First Lady reassured the rescued girls of the federal government's commitment to supporting their education. Since the incident, law enforcement officers from various agencies worked tirelessly to ensure your return home. Today, we will be giving you a scholarship grant of one million each. We'll give you a brand new laptop. And uh, not only that, the government is giving your parents two million each, you know, for all they've been through. And also the VC is some of one million. The representatives of the National Security Advisor while handing over the girls said the first ladies meeting with the rescued girls is very significant. Very, very um, apt to bring them to the first lady, for the first lady to meet them and also speak to them. Uh, the lesson is we continue to pray for Allah's guidance and support because it's only through supplication we'll be able to overcome situations like this. Present at the meeting were the parents of the rescued girls who shared their experience. I really appreciate what the First Lady, Mama of the, the Mother of the Nation has done to us. We are grateful. We are grateful. May Allah keep protecting them wherever they are. In fact, I'm happy. It is expected that this ordeal will not deter their fight to gain proper education in Nigeria. Uloma Oyemachi, ITV News.